Hi everybody. So I wanted to do this video and I wanted to talk about my grandpa first of all and who he was before I get started. So this was my grandpa. This is when he worked in a sheet metal shop for um, about 40 years and this is probably where his IPF came from. And then this one was just a simple picture of him at the beach before he got diagnosed. Well, no, he was actually diagnosed with IPF then, but it wasn't as bad. So he was diagnosed in 2018, and I think this was after that. Anyway, so even though he had that day at the beach, it got a lot worse after that. It got to the point where he could not move from one chair to the other without his oxygen levels going down to like 60 something. It got to the point where I had to give him a shower and it got to the point where we had to wheel him from one chair, like one room to the other room just so that he could go to the bathroom. We had to cook all of his meals for him. Um, we had to carry his oxygen for him. We had to help him down the stairs because we didn't have a ramp at our house. So just everything. I had to help him get dressed in the morning and help him get dressed at nighttime. I had to help put his, um, take care of his hygiene and his teeth and like, I just had to help him do everything. And it was an everyday thing for a really long time. And in the end, he ended up in hospice and he was there for less than 24 hours before he passed away. Um, my grandpa was Native American and he was in the Marine Corps. He had a military funeral. He was a great man. He was a family man and he would just do anything for anyone. So I think that he would want me to submit this video and I think that he wants to raise awareness for everyone and I think that he wants us to keep other people in our hearts and minds and thoughts and I think he wants us to pray for the doctors and the pulmonary fibrosis foundation and give them the knowledge pray that they get the knowledge that they need to overcome everything that they need to overcome and to find a cure for this awful awful thing so I hope this video helps someone and I pray that nobody has to go through this much, much longer. God bless.